The Siam Students Hub Terra at Kaust was founded in 2012 and uh, currently consists of students coming from Applied Mathematics, Computer Science, Science Computer Science and Electrical Engineering Department. KAUST uh, is a graduate level institute focusing on science and engineering, but it's unique of its own kind. It was, it's located on the Red Sea shore of Saudi Arabia, north of Jeddah, uh, and it's not just only a university, but also a small city. As a student chapter here at KAUST, we aim to promote SIAM uh, ideas through various activities open to the whole community. Uh, over the last few years, we have organized tutorials on different programming languages, run a co-cleaning service, and also collaborated with the Cow School on various projects. Not only did we take part in graduate student activities, but also we helped the younger generation with their problem-solving skills. Students from the Cow School would come to us with their trigonometry or calculus problems, and we'd help them develop a solution. This essentially helped us be more visible and active in a small community like KAUST. The Code Clinic is a service provided for students and researchers in KAUST who are new to programming and find difficulty due to their lack of experience in programming. So the Code Clinic volunteers who are experienced in a different vari and variety uh, types of programming languages, uh, they act like a family doctor who help the uh, students and researchers to go through their problems, find uh, where are the spots that are causing problems and then solve them. And that was a very good experience for me because I also learned the skills for myself, like teaching skills and also uh, sharpening skills in spotting problems in new programs. As a member of the Siam student chapter of KAUST, I recently took part in teaching of the basics of scientific computing using Python programming language. It was a very useful experience for me because it uh, I had to refresh my knowledge of the parts of scientific computing that I usually don't use myself in my own research. And it made me feel uh, that the field of scientific computing is very, very diverse and there is much stuff there that I can learn in my uh, future research. And this tutorial uh, is open for the whole university community. And in these tutorials we kind of have people about 30 people attending where they kind of learn how they can apply my, my, um, Python, MATLAB or different uh, programming languages to their different fields. Looking at the future, we are planning on maintaining links with the industries for career opportunities and CSE also for organizing field trips to the KAUS industrial partners. In general, we are planning on maintaining uh, links and involvement within and outside our interdisciplinary CSE community in KAUS. I got married to Siam in 1980 while still a graduate student. There were no student chapters in those days. It was difficult to get to a Siam meeting. There wasn't even a World Wide Web. So I read voraciously anything Siam sent that was career related. Being a Siam member is a matter of identity. There are very few mathematicians compared to the number of engineers and scientists. For example, the IEEE has 400,000 members. Most of the major societies have over 100,000. Siam has just 14,000. That means there's something in the power of abstraction that lets one applied mathematician serve so many of his or her scientific and engineering peers. Our fruits, our theory, our modeling, our algorithms, our software, in PDEs, in graphs, in optimization, in imaging, and so forth, ne and network us widely within the scientific community. But with respect to one another, we are sparse. So wherever I go, I try to start or induce others to start student chapters, including the last two institutions to which I've been appointed. When I came to Kaust in 2009, at a university that the Siam News proclaimed to be the world's first computational science and engineering university, a university that owned and operated for its exclusive use, the highest ranked supercomputer at that time, it was very natural to found the first student chapter in the Middle East, and even today you have to go about 3,000 kilometers to find the next one. Our chapter is a focus for networking, for advertising our presence, for outreach to our peers. We do free student-led training in mathematical software and in programming languages. I always tell people that Siam should be the second society for every engineer and scientist, but for us, it is our first. So we have to make it vital and visible for the few, the proud, the upcoming computational and applied mathematicians.